Hello everyone, in today's video I want to show you how to change the generated images output directory when using plant UML with ASCII Doctor. So let's get started. On my MacBook I have already installed ASCII Doctor and the plant UML processor and they are working without any problem together and also I prepared this file how to use plant UML, this ad hoc file let's have a look on it so this tag is telling is addressed to plant uml and this one this content should be converted into an image that the image will get this name here let's run the ascii doctor processor you need to add this flag diagram and specify the file name so this no error it works and if you see, so we have two files has been generated, the HTML and this image. When you see here, when you in the browser, we can see that everything works as expected. However, we have small issue or problem. In some cases, you want to put this generated file elsewhere, not on the working directory. So let me show you how to achieve that. You have to, there is two attributes that you can set. The first one, let's open the ad hoc file again and you can add this one for example image out there and you specify the location so you can use this attribute and you specify the output there you can use a relative path as well however you need to create the directory in advance let's say i created the directory and we will remove this image now let's run again and see what happened so no image has been created here and let's list the created directory and you see the image has been created there however we have a problem here we should also tell ASCII doctor the new location of the file so let me explain that this attribute tell plant uml where to put the images but you need to tell ASCII doctor where to get those images so therefore the second attribute images there now let's generate the files again and let's check here and as you see it is working so i hope you find this useful thanks for watching and bye